about yourself now? Fill um, us in. What do you want to know? Well, I'm... let's see. Uh, are your parents in show business? No. Okay. My dad's a dentist. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, what? I don't know why that's funny. <laughs> Still, but... Don't show um... her why that's funny? No. <laughs> the slide? I was just showing some slides. Um, yeah, I saw... <laughs> Well, they always laugh, though, even when they don't show slides about that. Yeah. But, um, yeah, my dad's a dentist, okay. and... And mom, she, is she in show she, business? No, she works with my dad. Okay. Yeah. So this was all your idea, you wanted yeah. to be in show business? Yeah, I used to watch my brother and my sister, they were in plays, and I just liked to perform, and so oh, okay. that's how it happened. And you were raised right here in Los Angeles? Yes, I was, okay. Ventura County. Because so. you remember sending me an audition tape when you were, like, I think, seven? <laughs> yeah, I actually did. Um, I never got a call back. So, um... I, I just got a chance to look at the tape, like, last week, you know. We yeah. get so many tapes, and I just saw it, like, last week, and I went, hey, she's on. Yeah, I thought it was pretty funny. Um, I never sent a tape to anyone else. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I sent one to you. Well, let's show people. This is the tape okay. you sent me when you were seven. Take a look. Hello, Mr. Lano. This is Amanda. I sure hope you like my act. What? Oh, sure, I'll hope. Yeah. I think you know why I never got a call back. Uh -huh. <laughs> I think I know why too. Um, yeah. So. Well, you know what's interesting? I, I found it. You went to. Uh, I was reading, but you went to comedy camp, or that's where you got to. Wh yeah. Where, where is? Uh, what's comedy camp? <laughs> um, it's at the Laugh Factory. It was yeah. just basically like kids you know, telling jokes, and comedians would come, like Arsenio Hall, Jay Moore, um, Richard Pryor, I got to meet once. So oh, it was cool. just oh, they would come like, to this, this comedy camp? Yeah, once a week, and they would just sort of critique your act, and it was fun, so. So what kind of advice did they give you? What kind of advice? Um, I don't even remember, like, once in my act, I, like, would spray my mouth with binaca, and, like, I actually brought binaca, and I think Jay Moore said, you know, just pretend you don't have to actually bring binaca. Have to bring the you. binaca. Like, I had all these props, like, and oh. I was fumbling, so. <laughs> So, yeah. So, how old were you, like seven or eight? Yeah, I was actually ten when I did that, and that was when I was uh, noticed for all that, yeah. and that was a show I did. This wasn't sleepover I... camp or anything? No, just... no, you just went once a week. It was fun. It was just basically, you know, a way to, you know, tell jokes, meet friends, and stuff now, Jim, like that. Jim, what advice? a really sick mom to go to that camp? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. Like stage moms, you mean? Yeah, no, sick, really sick, mentally ill. <laughs> No. Like depraved in it some way. I'm not sure I'd want Jay I would, Moore see, talking to If I had a comedy camp, yeah. that would be a prerequisite. Yeah. No one gets in without the sick mom. Yeah. Yeah. And would you want a bunch of sleazy comics talking to your daughter? I'm not no, sure. Really? Yeah. Well, hey, but there, yeah. was like, there was like 25 kids and like yeah. parents. It was like a friendly family thing. It wasn't like freaky. Now, Jim, if you had gone to the camp, what advice would you have given well, you? Father McMurphy would have said to the children. <laughs> Kids, come around, sit, grab my hem. There's something to tell you. A little story. It's interactive. Oh, God. No, is it, is it? no I, I don't know. That's, you know. Yeah. I would be a danger to the children. Yeah. For sure. <laughs> it's a good thing you weren't there then. Yes, yes. But you got your own show at, at 13. Yeah. So that, I, that was pretty Now, did you get that? discovered at Comedy Camp? Yeah, that's like where I And got an actual discovered. talent scout actually went to the camp. Yeah. Wow. Oddly enough. Yeah, and then I just started doing the show, and it okay. was fun. I played different characters, and okay. then... And you, and you just do sketch start... comedy? Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, I just started, you know, doing that, and I liked to perform. And then I uh, did Big Fat Liar, and then yeah. I did um, What a Girl Wants. Uh, yeah, and then What I Like About You, which is the show I'm doing now with Jenny Garth. So, so did you do a lot of physical comedy? In, yeah, in I did, you know, sort of just following around yeah. and doing all that. Um, cool. I was actually... Always a big fan of you. Oh, thank you. Well, who isn't, though? Um, oh. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. And, um, yeah, so I'm having a good time. I like to do it, and I'm, you know, enjoying myself. So. Yeah. I mean, did, did, did you ever get hurt? Did so, you know? what kind of a fan? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm um, No, go ahead. Continue. <laughs> Um, I suck you back into my vortex. <laughs> um, yeah, I actually did get hurt. Um, there was this one scene that I did with uh, Keenan Thompson, and we had ping pong paddles, and we were supposed to hit each other in the head in the scene, and through the magic of television, we were supposed to switch voices, but during rehearsal, I actually hit myself in the face with it and cut my lip open, and it was like gushing blood, and I had to have stitches, and actually couldn't do the scene, so. That's his act. That's your act, hitting yourself. Yeah. <laughs> Jim. <laughs> right. Anyway, the picture is, is, is what a girl Comedy wants. Camp.
It's in theaters now. What a girl wants. Amanda, thank, thank you very much. You. <laughs> thank you, Amanda. Thank Amanda you. Bynes, be right back with Tim McGraw right after this. <laughs> tomorrow night, and he'll be at the uh, Anna, uh, Arrowhead Pond in Anaheim on Saturday. His latest CD is self-titled. Please welcome Tim McGraw on the dance hall, Doctor. Hey, Cowboy, happy birthday. Thank you. Have a seat. Oh. <laughs> Where did that come from? Right, no, you do it next How you been? Dad. Happy birthday. How old now, can I ask you? 36. I'm in a new demographic now. New demographic, yeah. <laughs> Start getting that poly grip in the mail. Uh, no, I don't yeah. know if I can wear these jeans anymore. <laughs> well, you look good, buddy. It's always a pleasure to have you. <laughs> this is the new CD, Tim McGraw. There it is right there. Always a pleasure. Say hi to your wife and family I'm for me. Please right. do, please do. Thank I want you. to thank all my guests, Amanda Bynes, uh, What a Girl Wants, and of course, uh, Jim Carrey, Bruce Almighty, opens next week. Folks, stay tuned for Conan. Very special Claymation show coming up next. See you tomorrow night. Good night, everybody. Bye-bye.